Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to some more wonderful Webulus Project Zomboid. I don't remember what we we're doing. <laughs> uh, it's been a day and so uh, in typical Mathis fashion, I've my brain is gone. I don't remember what we were doing. I think we had a, well, la I know for sure last episode uh, we were dealing with bizarro zombies spawning on the roof and I'm hoping that that's not the case right now. I'd also like to head into town. That's the thing I want to do is I want to head into town and uh, continue trying to get like the proper tools and such to really get construction going, to build a wall, build a wall. Cause you know, politics. Um, and, and kind of get things just working properly here. Uh, there's some other things I'd like to do as well, and I'm gonna kind of tackle that right now. One of the things I really should remember to do at the very least is head into these houses and uh, be smart about the doors and like actually just remove them completely. We can go into carpentry and just disassemble the doors. Okay. Uh, and, and we can actually make, you know, make that work. Hey. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and just go ahead and shove you to the ground. Or not. Oh god, he all of a sudden picked up some speed. He's not lunging, but he is faster. I'm gonna push you, hopefully to the ground. There we go. Uh, excuse me? Did you see that? My guy wouldn't stop. There we go. And there's somebody banging away at the in the in the doors in there. We're gonna go clear them out. I'm gonna try and take down. Oh my god. Am I just is my character just exhausted? That's what it's starting to feel like. Um, yeah, I want to get in there too if I can. I might just try and beat it down. I have a bat. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Out, out the door. You are fast. You are fast mama jama. You are fast mama jama. There we go. I guess that one was just very, very strong. Um, why don't we... I'd love to disassemble this. Oh, I can. I could just disassemble this door for no good reason. All right, good. That's weird. But that's good as well. Duct tape, nails, nails. I don't really need the other hammer. Uh, was it really worth it? Not particularly, but again, it's upping our carpentry skill. Slowly but surely, at least. Where is it? There it is. Yeah. Um, let's, let's keep on kind of just disassembling doors. We should be safe to do it. Come on. So we got at least, what, two planks here? Two planks. All right. Uh, we'll disassemble just the doors for now. Oh, there's a car key here. But there's no car nearby. Interesting. That's fine. Disassemble. And disassemble... No? There we go. We got a few planks. And that's good. Um, I'm going to leave it for now. I'm not going to take these back and board them quite yet. Uh, what I want to do... Is head back out into the city if I can. Um, and see if I can still find myself an axe or something. I'd really, really like to make that work. Um, and I know, obviously, we have we have a little bit of an issue uh, in that there are a lot of kind of hordes out there, at least right now. And we kind of have to be a little wary of that, but I still think we can make it work. Thing is, that little warehouse that, and it's not really a little warehouse, but that warehouse that we were in is kind of a no-go at this point. Uh, there's too much there. This house was burned down. I'm gonna ignore it. Was it burned down? Has it always been burned down? I just never noticed it. Have I not really gone up this way before? All right, there's another house with the car there. I just wanna kinda keep an eye and a focus here on the road. I don't wanna lose real that much sight of the road here. There's the church. I kind of want to explore the church if I can. So let's let's do that. Oh, there's, a, there's a heck of a heck of a group. A heck of a heck of a gathering out there. 
I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get in really safely. There's only one door. All right. Well, I mean, it's not worth it to. I can maybe clear out like the broken glass. That'll give me an in. All right. We can get in there, I think. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Let's kill him. Let's get rid of him. Jesus. All right. Here they all start coming. Can I, the great Mathis Dini, make this work? Two down. Still would love to get a watch. You know, if any of the zombies want to hook me up. It's been a while. I haven't had a watch in any of my playthroughs recently. Oh, so that is the horde. That little, I don't even want to call it a horde, really. It was just like a little gathering. Stay down. God, man, they take forever sometimes. Just gonna get some glass out. All right, well, there's a second floor, but not actually, I guess. I wonder if we could like build something and actually get up there. It's weird that we that, that there's a second floor like put on this building. I have a feeling maybe it's just two stories like a tall ceiling and we would end up falling. That would be my guess. <sighs> quick kills, quick kills. Oh Jesus. How do they see me or are they just like, are they, are they tickling each other and getting each other all riled up? That's what it seems to be. I don't necessarily think they saw me. Uh, I think somebody moved into a tree and it like spurred the entire of the, the entire group of them to, to move around. Which makes sense. She's still after me. There's another group there. God damn it. Back up. Don't want to get surrounded. Yeah, I ran. But they're all banging on that door now. Just want to grab this car key. Because this car can be something I can, I can do at some point and grab it. I'm gonna have to go buy this little uh, this little grouping over here. Not gonna much of a choice. Seems they've pushed their ways through the trees now, and they're kind of around that car. So they've got they've gotten out of the main line of sight. These guys are getting distracted. This is weird. It's so weird how the zombies all group up in in such bizarre ways now. Gonna walk, not gonna bother. I'd like to get into this gas station, maybe. That's where the alarm went off. Okay. Yeah, that's why there's so many over here. Because this is the building. No, that's the hotel. Never mind. Why are there so many zombies over here? This is not even like. I'm not even in the city, man. Let's keep moving. We have no food on us right now, unfortunately. And I have no idea if there's anything up this way, but I want to just get away from where clearly the majority of the zombies are currently standing. All right, let's take a look at this. So this is a little shack. Looks like you could buy stuff here. A little chef shack. Can I get inside? Can I disassemble it? Just I, I was nervous I was gonna make noise, so I'm gonna re-equip this. Equip this on secondary. 
I love that if a door is locked, as long as the door swings towards you, you can actually just pop into it, no problem. Pistol. Okay, a zombie just showed up right there. I don't know if you noticed that. Like, where did you come from, dude? Goodbye. Not even gonna bother. Not even gonna deal with you. I just want... Maybe I can do some foraging over here. Maybe I'm far enough away from, like, the town where this is, like, a forageable area. I can! Alright, we might be able to start making ourselves a shitty axe. I just want materials. Though I should be looking for berries. I don't know if all berries are edible in the game. <laughs> just gonna keep an eye out. Did I get anything? Did I just get nothing? Okay, I got a chipped stone. So, if I want to make something, and I want to make, like, a garbage axe. Chipped stone, tree branch, twine. So, I still need a tree branch. That's fine. I'm getting regular stones. Girl, I'm getting stoned. Okay. Okay. I'm starting to get tired, too. Uh, see, I feel like this road is going to lead to nowhere. And wandering out that way is going to be a mistake. Do I go that way or not? Uh, I'm tempted. I'm tempted because I just want to explore a little bit, but... My inner, my inner survivalist is like, don't be stupid, don't go too far away. Because if you do, you're going to end up getting yourself in a position where you can't get your way home. And you're going to be lost. And Lord knows I have gotten myself lost in this game more times than I can count. Yeah, this all looks like back roads that will lead to other areas. Right, let's just go. A little bit of sprinting is going to be just to kind of push me out this way. We're faster than zombies as we walk, but I'm just trying to make up a little bit of time. Could do with a lie down, which is all fine. Don't I really don't think driving is all that worth it. Not yet. Not right now. Maybe at some point. But I just have no... I, uh, driving is just dangerous, it seems. It just It just attracts the attention of the unwanted. It's like being YouTube famous. I'm just, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's a joke. Now, nah, don't make those jokes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just, it's easy to make those jokes sometimes. It's, it's all just in good fun, you know. Would love. Oh, look at, look at this is. That's ridiculous. Just kind of like hoping I get a tree branch, I guess. Twigs. I don't think I could turn twigs into a tree branch. So, that's useless. I'm actually going to run by. There's plenty of space for me to run through. Just give a little bit of speed. Oh my god, look at them all. It's so weird. They're all weirdly clustered, man. It's so clearly video game cluster. Like, they're working off very specific logic. This is the this is the building I think I set the alarm off in. Ah shit. Let's move. I wouldn't mind pulling them away from it. Let's see if I can cut off vision on them. Yeah, I should check this too. How am I gonna get in there? You know what? Up and over. Up and over. There's just a lot. I've, I've called a lot of unwanted attention over here. 
But luckily we have a lot of uh, a tree line we can kind of disappear into. And they're gonna get they're gonna get themselves stuck. Look at this already they're already wandering off. That's the benefit, man. I've always said it. Like zombies are are not that big. Even in, in large clusters, they're not that big of a threat. It's your own stupidity that's gonna get you killed. And you have to keep that in check. Zombies are slower than you. Even the fastest zombies are slower than you are. At least during uh, on these settings, unless I'm not doing like rage zombies right now. Yeah, I've already lost them all. Could you not? Getting tired. Might try and dip into a house and spend the night in the house in a house. Bang bang ladies and craft. Close curtains just in case. Here, let's uh turn the TV off. What, three, four, five? There's a heck of a a pod walking by. This feels unsafe. I kind of want to crash here for the night. Yeah. She's going to bang on that window. Yeah, and now she's drawing the attention of them all. Let's grab some food. Eat the pie. Grab the cheese. We're going to get out of here. We got plenty of time. Okay, maybe not. We're just going to dip. Luckily, the window bang did attract everybody who was out front to the side. So I'm able to go around. And they did break that window, which also caused some noise. However, I might be able to clean these two out very quickly and hit in one of these houses for the night. Do I really need to be in one of these houses for the night? Uh, no, probably not. Is there somebody in here? Doors busted wide open. So, probably. Ooh, thunderstorm. Yeah, broken window, broken door. Uh, the thunderstorm is, a, is great though for my plants, so I'm not too concerned about watering my plants now. Where can I go for the night? Suck. Maybe this little shed? Burn down house. I think I can sleep on the chair if I really want. Wood glue is actually useful. Charcoal, maybe? More nails. Yeah, somebody there. How did you survive the house burning down, my friend? That's what I want to know. Hey, did you do this? Did you try and burn yourself down? Thanks for the key to your house. Well, at least you got half a bed in here. We can go ahead and drink. Fill our water bottle. Well, another kind of semi-failed scavenging mission because everything up north is very, very dangerous. Um, it may be worth it for us to try and head south at this point. And uh, try and make uh, maybe some looting down south work. 
These areas seem relatively safe, at least. Only a few zombies here and there that we can actually quickly kind of dispose of. This whole neighborhood alone seems relatively calm. It's a busted window over there. Come on. Now let's see if an alarm goes off. Nope, we're good. This knife has at least a bare minimum of two uses in it. Possibly some food. No medical supplies. Another water bottle. Carrots. I'm going to leave those in there because, I'm, like I said, I'm probably going to end up spending the night in this... A V1 remote. I'll grab that. I don't know what that's useful for, but it sounds cool. Um, we'll, we'll probably end up spending the night here. Twine. We ne We definitely need twine. Another car key. Awesome. All right. Well, I'm pretty happy with with uh, with this as like a nice little safe house, at least temporary one. I'm going to wrap this episode up here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying. If you are, let me know in the comment section below by hitting the like button. Your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.